Hello and welcome back to this channel. Dear students, this topic is solved problems of choppers, rather DC choppers. So, I will explain you how to solve the numericals related to step up and step down choppers. This is the list of formulae. So, this formula, this list is sufficient to solve any numericals related to DC choppers. First formula is V0 average, that is average output voltage. It is given as D. D is duty cycle into Vs. Vs is the supply voltage. It is the generalized formula. For general chop choppers, it is applicable. If it is a step up chopper, formula is Vs upon 1 minus D. Sometimes the chopper drop is given. In that case, if chopper drop is given, then this equation becomes in place of V, we have to write Vs minus Vch, where Vch is the chopper drop into D as it is. Then second formula V0 RMS that is RMS output voltage is root, do, root D Vs that is this is the generalized formula and if chopper drop is given very simple root D ye Vs ke badle mein likhna hai Vs minus Vch where Vch is the given chopper drop. Duty cycle D is T on upon T. T is the total time period which is combination of on and off time. So T on is on time period so T on upon T. Output power, this is the formula V0 is Vs minus Vch. Vch is the uh, chopper drop, chopper voltage drop. So Vs minus Vch bracket square upon RL. RL is the load resistance into D. D is the duty cycle. Input power, P in is Vs in the bracket Vs minus Vch into D upon RL. Efficiency is eta, that is P0 upon P in into 100%. Let us discuss the first numerical. A chopper circuit is operating on TRC principle, that is on time principle, at a frequency of 2 uh, kilohertz. So, given frequency, given is the value of F, that is 2 kilohertz. We know that kilohertz is 10 raised to 3 uh, hertz, so it can be written as 2 into 10 raised to 3 hertz. So this is the given value of frequency. On uh, 220 volt. So given value of Vs is 220 volt. If load voltage is 170 volt, this is the given value of load voltage. Calculate first part conduction period of chopper, second part blocking period of chopper, third part RMS output voltage. Now this 170 volt, this is the given value of uh, load voltage. So this value is actually V0 average. So V0 average is given as 170 volt. Now we have to do these different calculations. First we will calculate the value of total time period. Do remember total time period is T on plus T off. That is addition of on time period and off time period. Given is the value of frequency, use the basic rule. Total time period is reciprocal of frequency that is 1 by F. So it is 1 by 2. But this value is given in kilohertz. So it is 1 by 2 into 10 raised to 3. Therefore, this T will be 0 0.5 into 10 raised to minus 3. That is 0 0.5 millisecond. This is the value of total time period. Now, since nothing is mentioned in the question, we will be using generalized formula. So we have V0 average is D into Vs. So I am making use of first formula. We have to calculate conduction period of chopper. Conduction period means on time period of a chopper. So I am making use of first formula V0 average is equals to D into Vs. So V0 average this value is given as 170 volt. I will write it like this 170 is equals to D. Value of D. D is the duty cycle. We know that D is T on upon T. So I will write it like this T on upon T. This is D into Vs. Value of D is duty cycle is T on upon T. So I have put the value T on upon T into Vs. Value of uh, given value of Vs is 220 volt. 220 volt. This is T on upon T. From this we can write the equation of T on as 170 into T upon 220. So it is 170 into T. T is this 0 0.5 milliseconds. Milliseconds means 10 raised to minus 3 upon 220. So if you solve this, you will get the value of on time period. 
So this value is 0.3863 milliseconds. This is the answer of on time period. Second blocking period of chopper. Blocking period means off time period. Make the thing simple. Total time period is T on plus T off. So I can well write like this. T off is equals to T minus T on. Therefore, second part can be written as T off is equals to total time period is T that is 0.5 milliseconds. So everything is in milliseconds. So I'm not uh, converting anything minus 0.3863 milliseconds. So this answer is 0.1136 milliseconds. Everything was in milliseconds. So I haven't made any conversion. This is the answer of second part that is blocking period of chopper. Third part RMS output voltage. We have a direct formula V0 RMS is root D into Vs. So third part V0 RMS is equals to root D. We know that D is a ratio T on upon T. So I will write it like this root D. See, we are calculating this value root, uh, V0 RMS root D into Vs. So root D is, we know that D is T on upon T. Put the value of T on that is 0.3863 into 10 raised to minus 3 because it is in milliseconds divided by total time period T on upon T. So total time period is 0.5 into 10 raised to minus 3. Again, it is in milliseconds. So I put the value of D that is uh, T on upon T and we are making use of this formula root D into Vs. So I have put the values into square root sign into Vs. Value of Vs is given in the question that is 220 hold. So if you solve this on the calculator, this value is 193.37 hold. So this is the value of RMS output voltage. Next problem, a step up chopper is operated from 200 volts DC supply. Do remember given is the step up chopper and operating voltage is 200 volts. So Vs is equals to 200 volts. And it provides 360 volt output. That means this value 360 volt is value of average output voltage. So V0 average is 360 volt. If chopping frequency is 5 uh, kilohertz, so F is 5 kilohertz and we know that kilohertz means 10 raised to 3 hertz. So I will write it over here, 5 into 10 raised to 3 hertz. Calculate on and off times of the chopper. That means we have to calculate T on and T off. But keep in mind, this is step up chopper where formula are slightly different. First, we will calculate the duty cycle D. How to do it? V0 average is given. For step up chopper, we have the formula V0 average. V0 average is equals to Vs upon 1 minus D. This is the formula for uh, step up chopper. From this, we can write the equation like this. 1 minus D is equals to Vs upon V0 average. Very simple, this V0 average is transferred at the RHS. This term 1 minus D is transferred at the LHS. Therefore, from this I can write D is equals to 1 minus Vs upon V0 average. Rearrange ke equation here, D yaha pe transfer kiya and this term is transferred over here or phir LHS or RHS interchange karke equation leke hai. So, it is 1 minus Vs upon uh, V average. So, put the values, Vs is 200 upon V0 average is 360. So if you do this calculation, then this answer of D will be 0.4444. This is the value of duty cycle D. Now we have to calculate T on and T off. So let us first do the calculation of total time period. Total time period, we know that it is T on plus T off. And we have the generalized formula total time period is 1 by F which is 1 by 5 into 10 raised to 3 hertz. So this gives me value of T that is equals to 0.2 milliseconds. This is the value of T. 
Now recall the formula. We have duty cycle T is equals to T on upon T. T is the total time period. From this, I can calculate T on as D into T. Therefore, T on is equals to value of D. We have just now calculated it is 0.4444 into value of T. T is 0.2 milliseconds. 0.2 into 10 raised to minus 3. Since it is milliseconds, I have multiplied it by 10 raised to minus 3. So, if you do this calculation, then value of T on will be 88.88 .88 microseconds. Micro means 10 raised to minus 6. So, this is the value of on time period. Now, Make the thing simple. Ye formula use karna hai is say T off can be written as T minus T on. So put the values. Value of T is 0.2 milliseconds. That is 0.2 into 10 raised to minus 3 minus T on 88.88 into 10 raised to minus 6. Therefore, answer of T off will be 111.12 microseconds. So these are the two final answers we have calculated on and off types of step up chopper. Next problem, a step down chopper is operated from 230 Holt uh, DC supply. That is given value of VS is 230 Holtz. It has a resistive load with value of resistance 10 ohm. So R is equal to 10 ohm. When chopper operates, voltage drop across it is 2 hold. Now remember it. This is the voltage drop across chopper. So let us denote it by VCH. Because whenever the chopper operates, certain voltage drop takes place across it whose value is given as 2 hold. So let us denote it by VCH. Voltage drop across chopper. If duty cycle is 40%, 40%, this is 40% means 0.4. Calculate first part average and RMS output voltages, second part average and RMS output currents, third part chopper efficiency. Now first part average and RMS output voltages. See this is a step down chopper. We have a ready made formula for a step down chopper. So we have the different formula whenever the voltage drop across chopper is given. So for given chopper drop we have V0 average is equals to I am reading this formula first formula this this one for given chopper drop it is Vs minus Vch into D so it is 230 minus 2 Vch is 2 into D is 40 percent that is 0.4 so value of V0 average is 91.2 volt next in the same part we have to calculate V0 RMS that is RMS value of output voltage. Again, make use of the formula which contains VCH. So it is root D Vs minus VCH. So I will write square root of 0.4 into Vs 230 volt minus VCH2. So answer of V0 RMS is 144.2 volt. This, these are the answers of first part. Second part, average and RMS output currents. Use the basic formula. Current is voltage upon resistance. Value of R is given in the question. So directly I can write I0 average is equals to V0 average that is 91.2. This value upon value of resistance that is 10. So it is 9.12 ampere and I0 RMS. Same logic V0 RMS upon resistance. So 144.2 upon 10 that is 14.42 amperes. So these are the answers of second part. Third, it is asked to calculate the chopper frequency. Look at the formula of chopper frequency. It is eta which is equals to P0 upon P in into 100%. For this, we need to first calculate value of P0 and P in. This is the formula for calculation of P0. I am talking about third part. So P0, this value is Vs minus Vch bracket square. Vs is 230 minus Vch is 2 bracket square upon RL. 
RL is the uh, load resistance that is 10 same as R uh, into D, D is 0.440%. So value of P0 is 2079.36 Watt. Same way calculate P in, P in is equals to, we have this ready made formula Vs that is 230 inside the bracket Vs minus Vch 230 minus 2 into 0.4 upon 10. So if you solve this, you will get answer of P in is 2097.6. Now last step efficiency is P0 upon P in that is 2079.36 upon 2097.6 into 100%. So if you do this calculation, then value of eta is 99.98%. This is the answer of efficiency. So dear students, this is all the possible variations as far as this uh, numericals of uh, choppers are concerned. So that's it for today's session. Thank you. Thanks a lot for watching this video.